Hey guys, the new Morbius trailer just came out, so let's take a look at and react. <laughs> Where's your volume, bro? Volume! Must need volume! Yeah, boy. Michael, I've known you since you were a child. Oh shit, who picks on a fucking disabled You're person? A gift. You always have. There's an answer to your disease. You'll find it. Okay, looks like he's sick, like he was... I should have died years ago. Hmm. Why am I still here if not to fix this? It's a doctor, too. I have a rare blood disease, and I'm running out of time. Mm. Mm. <laughs> this could be a last chance. Like Batman. <laughs> At what cost? Ooh, that was strong. Well, that's some shit to say about Sony in a second. Huh? 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 Kill people, you eat them. How far are we allowed to go? Hmm. Using something that's broken. Until the remedy. Is worse than the disease. Ooh. Ooh. Cool. So it looks like Sony is trying to bring another character maybe into the Spider-Man universe of theirs, which they didn't build, but now they have, thanks to Marvel. And uh, yeah, so it looks like Morbius interacts with uh, Vulture. Uh, looks like maybe there's some other names dropped in there. I couldn't really tell. But... I couldn't tell either, but the Vulture thing, what? Hold on a second, Sony. Yeah. Hold on a second. Sony almost wrecked it when they took when they almost took Spider-Man out of the MCU, now it seems like they're like, oh shoot. We realize everyone thinks that we suck. We should probably just join them. Ah. Oh. So they've already smart. made Venom, which is already now in a part of the Spider-Verse. Now they have Morbius, then they got the Sinister Six, which Morbius might be associated with, maybe not. Uh, well, he's obviously associated with them somehow. But in the comics, Blade is also associated with Morbius. Ooh. So maybe in the future they can do a crossover thing like they did with Spider-Man. Yes. They are making a Blade movie. Marvel's making a Blade movie. So. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, this is how they can do the their own Spider-Verse. But it better stick with some Marvel, Sony, you hear me? Stick with Marvel. They know what they're doing. So who knows? We saw Vulture. Maybe Tom Holland as Spider-Man will make an appearance. Maybe uh, Tom Hardy as Venom make make an appearance. Maybe Carnage could make an appearance. Who knows? Whoa. There's a couple big characters they dropped in the last couple of movies. Plus Mysterio still might be out there. I think he is. He's got to be. He's the master of illusion. Seriously? Mm -hmm. He double-faked Spider-Man somehow at the end. He did it. I don't know how, but he did yeah, so Morbius is a living vampire, gets powers from bats, and has a lot of bat powers. Like, not Batman. Not like, unlike Batman, <laughs> he actually has bat powers. Uh, yeah, he's gonna eat or drink blood, essentially, from living humans to, to stay alive. He's got that urge. 
He's got sonar. He's got teleportation, it looks like, like Nightcrawler. Yeah. Extra baby beefed up strength. So it looks good. I'm hoping it's kind of the same vein as Venom where, like, it's dark, but it's funny. But at the same time, like, this is a guy who kills people. And he's yeah. not really a good character. I don't want this shit to be funny. I want this to be serious as fuck. Right? And then they introduce it into something. Like, dude, if this is really gonna be it then they better do a good job you hear me sony again you better do a good job from the company that brought you homecoming and far from home sure that was all you guys okay yeah well you know what the past two spider-mans you destroyed this one since marvel has it right it's gold it is the best it is amazing this is spider-man so, without a third Spider-Man announced yet, it'd be interesting to see if after it. Morbius we get some more characters, or if not, I hear Spider-Man and the Spider-Verse is going towards a Sinister Six, so maybe Morbius will be a part of it. Somehow. Um, yeah, they, got a, they got a pretty good actor in uh, Jared Leto, and he looks really good, and hopefully it's good. So, check out the trailer, give us a comment down below about what your favorite part was, and maybe how you see him fitting into the Spider-Man universe.